What's up guys? Today I'm going to be showing you how to make a monkey ball the easy way. So first off what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to get four pencils, a piece of cardboard about three four inches by three four inches wide, about 25 feet length of paracord, a lighter, a golf ball or any other kind of ball you really want, a rubber band, and a paracord fid if you would like. But it makes things a lot easier, but you don't you don't really need it. Okay, so first what you're going to want to do is you're going to take your ball, in my case a golf ball, then take your pencils and you're going to mark out the holes around the, the about four spots where you want the pencils to go. Okay, so I've already measured those, so I'm just going to put this together. Insert the ball in your set up and put a rubber band around it. Now this is a lot easier than say using your fingers or even going out and buying the setup that is more professionally made but it costs money and this is this is free. So I'm going to be using my FID. So just unravel your rope was a little bit tangled. Okay, now what you want to do is have about probably six inches of excess rope. Hold it and wrap it around the setup that you've made about, let's see, probably about seven times okay then what you're going to want to do is you're going to make sure is then take your your paracord you can remove the rubber band if you would like to I'm going to do that after I wrap around this a couple times go through the middle here pull it all through and then take your rope go through the middle pull it all through so now you have one loop around the middle okay now I'm gonna go ahead and remove these rubber bands makes things a lot easier so you just go you keep doing this until you have seven or however many however many strands that you have however many wraps around you have until you have seven more around the middle okay and don't do it super tight okay we want it to be a little bit loose for later we're going to tighten it up later so just continue to do this until you have however many you need to cover up the entire ball. All right, now we have seven strand, seven wraps around all of the, around both, both ways. We can carefully slip out the pencils as we no longer need them. Make sure you don't mess up any of the wraps that you've made. Very important. Okay, now what we're going to do take your paracord and go through these loops that we have now 
This is where a FID would come in handy if you have one. And just do the same thing you were doing earlier. Go all the way around until you have seven or however many you need to cover up the whole ball. Make sure you do this very carefully as you don't want to mess up, mess up the wraps you've made. Sometimes you just need to go through, see how you have these curls, just undo those. It makes things a lot easier. Just kind of pull them throughout the rest of the cord that you have. Now you have nice flat rope again. Makes things a whole lot easier. Once you have that done, you'll have this really loose, monkey ballish looking type thing. And this is this is the part where we're gonna start tightening tightening it up. Now before that, make sure all your paracord all your lines are lined up in a nice orderly flat row on every side. Make sure they're all in order. You don't want them crisscrossing underneath here that it's not fun when that happens. Okay, so then you're going to take you're going to take the string that's about six inches long from the beginning, and you're going to start. And you're going to go onto the ball. Try and hold this down. You don't want this to go. You're just going to start pulling. And tightening down the strands. Don't go too much at a time. It's probably going to take probably two or three passes until you until you have it all nice and tightened down because you want to make sure it's nice and even. So just go a little bit at a time. Don't make it too tight. And just keep going until you have the whole ball done. And just do that as many times as necessary until it's all nice and tight and even and flat. <laughs> round, I mean. And so on and so forth. Make sure you don't pull this too hard, because if you do, see, it'll pull and make a hole like that. So you want to be very careful at the intersections where the string goes from one side to another. Alright, there we go. Once you have your monkey ball finished, all nice and tight and even, then you can take this, you can take your two your two ropes, cut it to where they're not a nice even length, and then you can tie them up however you want. You can tie them down here, you can tie them up here. You can you don't even have to cut this. You can keep it nice and long, and then you can have a nice uh, weapon or some kind of some kind of weight, whatever you want. All right. Thank you for watching, and that's it.